Fresno State devoured conference rival Louisiana Tech Saturday in the WAC Conference Championship game, securing their second 25-point victory of the tournament. Both teams started the first 15 minutes of the game shooting evenly from the floor. Fresno shot 55% and La Tech shot 47. But that was before Rosie Moult decided to take the game into her own hands. Moult went on a scoring tear, sinking 11 points in a row. She led the dogs on a 27-6 run, drilling three consecutive three-pointers. Moult finished the game with 23 points and was selected to the 2012 All-WAC Tournament team. With high-intensity defense, the Bulldogs forced the Lady Texters into 10 turnovers and snagged five steals in the first half. Fresno was automatic from three-point range, hitting 10 of 20 from behind the arc in the first half. The Bulldogs set a whack record for threes made with 15. The Dogs went into the locker room with a commanding 18-point lead. The Bulldogs took their usual second-half approach, score as much as possible, and never let up. With eight minutes left to play in the game, Fresno extended their lead to 30 and cruised to an 89-61 win over the Lady Texters. Coach Adrian Wiggins and his dogs are going dancing, clinching an automatic bid to the NCAA tournament for the fifth straight year. I'm very proud of them. Uh, they, they're great on the court, they're great off the court, and you know I'm sure five years from now, ten years from now, it'll, it'll probably mean a lot more, but today I'm just excited for the players. Fresno State Athletic Director Thomas Bay was in attendance over the weekend and feels that leaving the WAC as outright champions is the best way to say goodbye. I think, it's, I think it's a great way to, uh, to, to, to leave. I mean, having been champions in this sport certainly helps out a lot. Ranking and seeding for the NCAA tournament comes out Monday, March 12th, and with a good seed, Wiggins feels that the Bulldogs can make a run and win a few games. Jeff Perlmutter, The Collegian Online.